Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I'm here to do the daily vibes for around the 12th. Okay, so we're just gonna see what comes up. Keep in mind the timing is still fluid. The Magician reversed. So the Magician reverse is a trickster. Losing power. This is a loss of power. Powerless. <laughs> Let's see what else we got to go with that card. No resources. Ten of Cups reversed. Ten of Cups reversed is unhappiness, an unhappy relationship, a broken relationship, an unhappy marriage. It's not good at home. There's relationship problems. This is like a dying dream. This is no desire to take any action. There's no resources. Not happy. Ten of Pentacles. Ten of Pentacles is about stability. It's about permanence. It's about long term. Now, there could be somebody that is, I don't know, there could be a, a, an inheritance that is coming. This is passing on, handing down. Could have something to do with family. There's family money or inheritance, something about money here. This is also about long-term stability. Somebody is wanting long-term stability. Now, there could be, now, there's something about money, okay? Somebody may have married for money. That's what it is. They married for money. Now there's no resources. Or they got into a relationship for money. Interesting. And maybe they did it because they didn't have any resources. Hmm. Somebody's losing their magic, put it that way. We have a liar. This is a thief. Okay, the magician reverse is a thief. Nine of Pentacles. Now, the Nine of Pentacles is somebody that is very independent. We may have something to do with an inheritance here or a stealing. This is theft. It is. This one is. And this is, we got money. We got money here. Theft of inheritance, maybe? That makes sense, at least in my world. Anyhow, Nine of Pentacles. Um, nine of Pentacles. That is somebody that is very self-sufficient. Can take care of themselves. This is, this is somebody that is very uh, capable of being successful on their own. This could be a business owner. This is somebody who is very skilled, very strong, very business-like. Okay? That is abundant, okay? The Nine of Pentacles is somebody that is abundant, valuable, has worked hard. So we have a hard worker here, worked hard for their money. But this, this, this magician reverses somebody that is a master manipulator. We have a trickster here. Hmm. 
Nine of Pentacles. That is somebody that is very stable. That has a lot to offer. That has worked really, really hard. Now, this is the storm is over. Somebody has been tricked or duped or lied to. And, you know, it's like something better that is coming. Interesting. Tch. Judgment reversed. Wow, somebody made a poor judgment call and they may not be forgiven. Interesting. There could be some legal implications. There could be some legal flaws. Something may not turn out as they thought it was going to. Now, judgment in reversed is a poor judgment call. There's lack of awareness here. There's definitely some lies. There's poor health. Somebody did not make the best decision. Okay, they didn't answer the higher call. Very focused on money. We got somebody that is in this reading that is very materialistic. And they're very focused on money. They may have married somebody for money. That's a, that's, and that will bring you some bad karma. <laughs> Yes, it will. So anyway, we got some bad karma here. For this master manipulator. Feels like we have somebody here that is trying to steal money. Three of Swords Reverse. Now this is letting go of past hurts. Leaving the past behind. It's like done. Forgiveness is definitely needed, but there may be a lack of forgiveness. It feels like there's, it's like, how can you be forgiven for doing that? You know, whatever it is, that's what I hear. This hurts. They hurt, somebody hurt another person. Selfish. Definitely very selfish. Anyhow, this three of swords reversed. This is releasing pain. It's time to leave. It's time to leave this hurtful, painful situation. That's what's going on here. It's the end of a really, this is the end of a painful situation. Ten of Cups reverse next to the Three of Swords reverse. This is the end. This is a permanent loss as well. It's almost like somebody was used for their money. They were married for their money. That was it. And they got into a commitment just for the stability that they could provide. Now, karma, which is judgment reversed, or upright, has stepped in and has probably... Uh -huh. Well... There's going to be a judgment call that is made and there's no forgiveness here. This is, there's, whatever. Let's see what we got. Um, we have a very independent person that is doing quite well. Totally unaware. Totally unaware that there's some money coming, which is interesting. There is some money that is coming. Four of Cups reversed. This is seeing a new opportunity. Looking forward now. Interested. So there's, there's something was missed. Something was missed. Now it's being seen. Interesting. Something is being seen. Somebody has, has been looking for information or they've been looking for more and now they see something better. It's 
It's the end. It's the end of stagnation. Now they're interested in something else. Going down another path or taking an opportunity. And letting go of regret. Somebody has some regrets. They feel really guilty. The Emperor. Oh, the Emperor. The Emperor is a father figure or somebody in a position of authority. This is a father. Um, it's, it's somebody that is very organized, very structured, very typically very wise, very experienced. This is typically an older man that has a lot of life experience. So this guy takes action based on his experience. He sees something he missed in the past. This, this is, he sees something he missed in the past. So he does. He does. This guy is interested in something. He is interested. He's interested in, in, in something else. He sees a new opportunity and he's going to be taking it. He wants to leave something behind that hurt him. He's ready. He's ready. He's ready for something. So he's going to be taking action. Turning his back on a painful, I mean, heart. This is heartache. Three of Swords is heartache. It's heart pain. It is. This is the end of a relationship. Somebody's going to be getting money, though. <laughs> Ten of Swords. Oh, my gosh. That stabbed right in the heart? Or what is that? That's the back. Look at the veins. Oh, my God. That ten of swords, that's painful. That is painful. Somebody's going to be... That's painful. That's like a death. It is. It's like a death. It's like the end of a situation. It's the end of a painful situation. This guy is now ready. Ready to move forward. This is done. I'm done dealing with this pain. I'm done with this relationship. I'm done being lied to. I have no desire to... Or no resources left. To, to do anything. Somebody may become independent. Okay. If they've been in a relationship. This 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 person is making a decision. And they may be leaving. Okay. Because this is independent. Going your own way. Um, there's the, This is the end of a situation. So this is. This is. Uh, not able to get up. Not getting up. This is like, I don't know what the hell this is, but you see that guy in the suit reminds me of the, uh, well, you know who it reminds you of. I hate to say it, but it reminds me of the, uh, you know, the guy at the funeral home. Who's that guy? What's that guy called? Um, the funeral director? Is that what it is? Um, I don't know. <clears throat> Judgment reversed. This is ill health. Guilty. Move on. It's time to move on from that bad choice. Somebody made a poor judgment call. They didn't act with integrity. They didn't listen to anybody's advice. Now there, there's a lack of forgiveness here. So I don't know what's happening. But anyway... Don't look good. Anyhow, this Ten of Swords is a painful end. I'm sure somebody could pretty that up for you, but we all know I'm not that girl. So, this is a painful end. This is, it's painful. This hurts. But people lie all the time. Anyhow, um, somebody hasn't been telling the truth. Huh. 
Anyhow, we have a mental or physical collapse here. This is the death of a situation. This is giving up. It's over. This is like a, it is, it's over. This is, it's, we have three tens, okay? Well, we actually have, well, we might as well say five tens because we have two of them on this judgment card. Completion, 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 completion. This is the end. It's the end of this heartache. It's the end of this pain. There is, there has been relationship problems, probably with the family, with that. There, there's, the whole family's been involved. Somebody chose money over love. Money, money, love. And they probably have some regrets. But I feel like it's too late. Oh, it is. Goodbye. See ya. Eight of Cups. Let me see what that little thing says. To the moon. Somebody is going. They're leaving. They are leaving. They're done. With holding on for the money. Be prepared to hear of a departure. This is the end of a situation that was brought together. For financial stability. It feels like somebody's health gets to the point where they can't get up. You know, they literally, or they don't wake up. J judgment, upright, is, aw is, is awakening. What's the opposite of awakening? This is reversed. Not waking up. And they may not have woken up in this lifetime. And they may not be forgiven. They may. Anyhow, this is the end with that last card being the Ten of Swords and goodbye. This is somebody that is leaving an emotionally uh, disturbing situation behind. It is. This card stayed down. Six of Swords. S goodbye. I'm going to a better place. It stayed down when I picked up the deck. And maybe it did. I didn't notice it till now. You know, when I showed you the Eight of Cups before, I was looking at the camera. And, and then I looked over here and I saw that card laying down. Six of, cu Six of Swords. That is moving on. That is good. That seriously, between the Eight of Cups and the Six of Swords, that is absolutely goodbye. Going to a better place. Taking a ride. So be prepared to hear of a departure. Somebody's leaving. They're leaving a situation that they were 
that they stayed in just for the money. And this is, and this is, and it's very sudden with that magician reverse. It's like, they just decide to go. It's like, you know, this is, this is like, they, they take, they do it without thinking. Okay. This is taking action without thought. Okay. It's like, ah, can't do this anymore. Goodbye. For real. This is goodbye. Good luck. 